Oh, what a moment this is as the notorious Conor McGregor, the champ champ, makes his return to the greatest proven ground in mixed martial arts. You know McGregor cares an awful lot about his MMA legacy, so you know this return to the UFC was an eventuality. Perhaps it took longer than many fans expected, but the present is Conor McGregor walking back to the octagon here tonight. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. Born in Dagestan, Russia, here is the UFC lightweight contender, the undefeated Khabib Nurmagomedov. At one point, 24 and 0, dominant every step of the way in his mixed martial arts career, training at American Kickboxing Academy under the likes of Javier Mendez. This is a gym that has produced many a champion, Joe. All indications are that Khabib Nurmagomedov could be next. This guy is taking shots to the jaw that would put many fighters unconscious and pressed forward as if nothing happened. His chin is legendary. And now our tale of the tape for this lightweight fight. Both fighters 29 years of age. McGregor will have a four inch reach advantage. Here for the official introductions, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC. The lightweight division, introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, a kickboxer holding a professional record of 21 wins, four losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds, fighting out of Dublin, Ireland, the notorious Connor McGregor! And now he is his opponent, fighting out of the red corner, a grappler for the professional record of 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. But out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Hakeema the Eagle Imamometov! And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yamasaki. So Mario Yamasaki, your third man in the Are octagon here tonight. And we are underway. The buzz is palpable inside this arena because Conor McGregor is fighting here tonight. The Irish fans are going sick. We'll see if Conor McGregor can get off to his patented fast start. You know he controls distance well. We'll see how McGregor approaches the early going here. And he connects with the punch there. Joe, your thoughts on what we might see here early? Nurmagomedov has very good striking. He has a full overall MMA game, but one thing to really keep an eye out for from him are his takedowns. Conor McGregor gets hit with a kick. He went for an elbow. Conor with a nasty kick to the body. A hook shot blocked there by Nurmagomedov. He comes forward with a flying knee that just missed hitting the target flush. Oh, he got cracked with the jab there, Joe, and his head is firmly on the center line, the one place it really can't afford to be. He's showing some vulnerability here by leaning right into his opponent's range. Let's see if he can make some adjustments here. One, two. Oh, McGregor's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Snapped off the jab nicely there. for the fences with that hook, but misses. Nurmagomedov gets caught with that punch. 
McGregor going for the head kick here, but no setup whatsoever, Joe, so nothing doing. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Wow! wow. He's got to be careful here. He's clearly in trouble. Under two minutes to go in a back and forth first round here. It was a single attempt. Oh! What a leg kick! And he doesn't get it. Now closes the distance. Tying him up here in the clinch. McGregor gets the tie clinch here. This is a very good spot for him, Joe. Caught him with a punch. And they disengage from the clinch. He's trying to establish that jab once again. 45 seconds remain in the round. And he's going to try to take the back. 30 seconds now to go in round one. Big right hand by Nurmagomedov. He hits him with a hammer fist. Final seconds here. He's got a full mount here. Round two straight ahead. Oh, oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Here's a perfect kick to the body. Here's a powerful leg kick. Here's a perfectly placed leg kick. Incredible highlights in that round. Brittany Palmer is here as well. Round two here. Now, starting off this round, you've got to think that the barrage that he endured in that last round is still affecting him. He's going to want to start this round off and move and avoid taking any damage. Habib Nurmagomedov is one of the best grapplers in MMA. He has knockout power in his strikes, and his big skill is being able to take guys down and maul them on the ground. Oh, man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Working on a single leg here. Oh, and down. McGregor gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. Oh, postures up and delivers a big ground and pound strike to the head. Nicely done there by Nermago Medoff. Good shot to the head. The fighters back to their feet here. How about that shin? That one hurt. Oh, tries a flying knee. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. And a nice kick. Oh, McGregor's kick is blocked. Mago Medov gets hit with a flush uppercut there. Oh, double jab. Oh! Front kick to the face! He's got him hurt here. A nice combination. Looking to set up a knee of his own. Conor McGregor with some body shots. Trying to get a single. And busy as he looks to improve position here. Both fighters back to their feet now. Locks up the plum. Deep breath there and reset. And there he swung with a haymaker. Oh, clipped him with the jab. Inside leg kick is there by Nurmago Medov. Oh, a huge block there. Just misses with the straight left hand. 
Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost... Oh, big knee! Knee! He is in trouble. Oh! Big body, body shot. shot there, too. Ten seconds to go here. Let's see what happens. And what a round! Up, up. And here's a nice shot, lands perfectly. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Ariane Celeste is with us. Defensively, this fighter is going to have to figure something out. Oh, kicked him in the face. He's got him hurt here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Back and forth we go. He tagged him again. He's hurt. Big uppercut to the head. Lands a powerful kick. Kick blocked by McGregor. Oh, another one! He's got him hurt here. Well, fortunate that one didn't land to the head. The hook shot blocked by Nurmago Meta. Well, it's all pace and pressure down the stretch. He is really lighting them up now. For the win. Yeah, man, crowd loving it. Just a gorgeous shot there to end the fight. Really just the way he drew it up. He found the opening and capitalized on it to the utmost extent. Nicely done to finish the fight. And here's the end of the fight. Let's take a look at that again. Look at this. Boom! Out cold. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop to this contest at 3 minutes, 57 seconds of round number 3. Declaring the winner by knockout, the no Well, what a legacy it has been for the two-division UFC champion, Conor McGregor, and he only adds to it here tonight as he gets his hand raised yet again. Doubt this man at your own peril, ladies and gentlemen. It seems like every time the doubters get on board, Conor finds a way to mute them all, and he does exactly
likely that here tonight. Another massive, massive win for the future UFC Hall of Famer, the notorious Conor McGregor.